guys welcome back to the channel and i hope you guys are doing absolutely fine this lab is very easy but we have to pay more attention while completing this lab because if you miss one single point of this particular video then you will be like okay i have completed all the things correctly but still not getting a score the reason is behind that if you miss one single point of this particular video which i am going to explain then you are not able to understand and then you are not able to complete the lab on your first attempt so i request you please watch the entire video and then try to complete the lab okay and don't worry i am going to explain each and every point and each and every task in detail so first of all just me log in with your credentials and once you're done with that come back over here just me click on this close now just me click on this document over here like this way okay let me just me close all this unwanted pop up okay now you can see project manager just me click over here type at the rate and type me me and from here you can see this student username just me choose that now for the start date just me click over here again type at the rate just me choose the date over here and just me choose the today's date like this way and then click on this ok now for the end date again just me type at the rate over here again just me choose the date over here now just me move forward next couple of month and then just me choose any date like this way then just me click on this ok and is it done now for the review status again just me type at the rate you can see this drop down click over here and just me choose the review status and from here just me choose the approve and as you can see it's done make sure that your box must look like this okay now just me select all this content over here then click on this add comment okay now here type any comment that you want like this way okay now give one space like this and type at the rate okay as you can see i'm not able to get any student username over here so if you are also facing this issue don't worry just me remove this and add plus icon over here and from here you can see this is student id so just me choose that let me just me choose that over here type that and choose over here wait for a second and here you can see assign to you just me click on this checkbox and then just me click on this assign make sure that you have to click on the checkbox like this way just me wait and it's done now if we just me hold over here and from here you can see this green tick just me click over here like this way and it's done now what you do just me click on this clock icon from here just me choose this second version click on this and then click on this make a copy and then click on this make a copy and it's done so this is our current version if i just may come back over here so this is our current version and this one is a previous one okay so we have done with the task number one and two now if i just may come back over here and if i just may check the score for the task number one and two i will get a score without any issue and if the score is not updated immediately don't worry just may wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a full score over here for sure okay now for the task number three and task number four just me come back over here if you want you can just me close this two tab click on this new then just me click on this google docs like this way okay now here first of all what you do we have to just me change the title name so just me come back over here click on this then click on the task number three scroll down a little bit so we are done with all this thing now just me copy this title over here and replace over here make sure that there is no extra space otherwise you will face the error okay now what you do we have to just me type this calendar event draft so just me come back over here type at the rate okay not here here just simply select that type calendar like this way so it's done now for this particular title just me scroll down and from here you can see this title over here so just me copy this and paste over here now for the guest copy this thing carefully and paste over here like this way okay now for the start date and end date i request to please pay attention click over here and from here you have to just me choose the next thursday date so as you can see this is our next thursday so i'm going to choose that now for the set timeout just me type 1 colon 0 0 pm that is 1 pm okay now for the end date what you do again just me click over here again just me choose the next thursday date like this way and for the end date just me type 2 colon 00, 00 pm that's the thing that you have to do make sure that you have to do this thing very carefully now let's suppose if you're watching this video on the next friday saturday sunday monday or tuesday still you have to choose the next thursday date okay click on this okay and it's done now for the description you can type anything like this way okay let me just correct the spelling over here okay so everything is done now what you do just me click on this calendar over here you can see just me click over here okay click on this got it 
now click on this save over here okay you will get this kind of pop-up like reload your website so just simply click on this reload button don't worry now click on this click on the save click on the send and then click on this invite all guests over here so that's the thing that you have to do if you want if we just simply move forward with the, that date you can see it's the register over here so we have done with the this portion over here now what you do we have to add a note over here so just simply come back to this tab click on this files click on this new over here and from here just which is a document now i request you please pay attention over here because i know most of you guys miss this part over here so first of all what you do we have to give the title so just me come back over here and from here you can see this title over here let me just me copy this thing okay this is a title okay so copy that and replace over here like this way now here just me type at the rate meeting notes you can see just me type that and just me select this note over here and you will see like this okay now i request you please pay attention you will get this kind of pop-up click on this attach over here like this way okay and you can see this att attachment sign over here make sure that you have to click on this attachment sign over here otherwise you will not get a full score okay so as you can see now it's grayed out now in the notes you can type anything like this way just may add couple of notes and it's done okay now if we just may come back over here and if we just may check the score for the task number three you will get a score immediately as you can see i got a score make sure that you have to click on that attachment which i showed previously so we are done with the task number three as well now task number four is very easy first of all if you want you can just may close this tab okay close this and if you can just may close this tab as well now here we have to do couple of things so just may hit enter button over here like this way now just may come scroll down over here and from the task number five you can see we have to come to the collaborative draft over here and from here we have to just make the building blocks so just may come back over here we can see we are on the collaborative drafts document so just may type at the rate building blocks see all building blocks just may click over here now from here just may click on this email draft over here click on this insert so it's done now for the two no need to add anything for cc no need to add for bcc no need to add for the subject line just me scroll down and from here you can see this subject line so just me copy this and paste over here like this way now for this help just me come back over here if you want you can just me copy this content as well copy that and paste over here that's the thing that you have to do you have done with all this part okay now please pay attention because i know most of you guys miss this point over here so first of all click on this close over here okay now if you just me check over here you can see suggest at this just me click over here so you are suggesting okay so it's done now what you do again just me select this part over here like this way and then click on this emoji add emoji and from here just me choose any emoji over here so as you can see it's added over here now just me hover over here like this way okay if you just me click on this you will get this resolve button just me click on this resolve make sure that you have to do these two points over here if you miss these two point then you will not get a full score okay now if i just me come back over here as you can see we have to click on this resolve button over here now if i just me scroll down and click on this check my progress i will not get a full score why because first of all we have to make sure that we have to remove this restricted tag so what you can do you can just me come back over here click on the share button over here from here just me choose a quick lab over here and for the viewers just me type a commenter like this way and it's done now click on this done everything is done now last point is remaining click on this gmail button it's creating a draft email and draft email is created over here let me just miss show you so as you can see everything is mentioned over here now if we just me come back over here and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue and in this way we have to complete this lab now if you are wondering from where i got this check my banner over here so what you can do just me open a new tab and type how to enable check my progress button on the quick lab and from here you can see this video just me watch that and you will understand how to get this check my button and in this way we have to complete this lab if you have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys